uh, every time they're in the same way that you have an electricity or a gas meter, and then um, you know you'll have to pay per mile. So it's it's independent from your uh, normal mileage on your car. It's a separate box. Probably. And, and, and then they'll have a way of uh, tracking you and making sure that you're sticking to the speed limits as well, and they'll send you uh, bills through the post if you happen to go over and above. And, e and even the old cars that don't have it, they'll have to go and have it fitted. Oh, yes, probably. And, and how, much, find how much would that cost? Absolutely, and then they'll find a way to charge you for that. Yeah. So, so what, why don't they then just uh, get rid of the, the packages altogether and, altogether and charge you for another fuel? Well, you see, I just think that that is a, a fair and reasonable way, but I don't want to give them any opportunity, Nick, to add even more fuel duty. Personally, they want to know how to fix the economy. All they're going to do is just get rid of or, or reduce road tax and then uh, reduce the amount that they take on uh, fuel duty and say for a temporary period of time, 20 pence off a litre and get people spending more, having more in their pockets and then going off and doing... I don't know, motoring trips and driving around and, and 